Welcome back to another episode of DIY Golf Car Garage. Today we'll be working on a G29, a Yamaha Drive, and we'll be changing out the reverse buzzer. I got the car, all I need is my gloves. Let's get it. Okay, so, so that you can see where the reverse buzzer is, the front cowling has been removed. So normally right here, you would have your front bumper, and you would reach behind it, and you would fill right in the very middle of this cross member, this rubber bushing here, this holding on to the reverse buzzer. You just pop it loose. It goes back to a little coupling that has squeeze plugs on both sides. You'll squeeze them and pull it right out. And it's a good thing. No wonder this thing wasn't working. Look how corroded it is. Let's get this thing cleaned up and see if we can make it work again. We've got the buzzer all cleaned up now. Cleaned out the connector. So what I'm going to do is put it back over here. Hook one of these little ears at a time. And yes, it will be a little bit more difficult when you're laying on your back. But let me connect it up now. And see if it cleaned up and works. Fantastic. Now people know if I'm backing up. Well, I hope today's episode, changing out or at least cleaning up and cleaning the connections of a reverse buzzer to a Yamaha G9 was helpful. Basically, all the Yamaha reverse buzzers are in the same location. So, if you got any of them, that's how you do it. Please don't forget to subscribe, leave me any comments that you want. And once again, thank you for visiting us here at DIY Golf Car Garage.